AI or human-computer interaction creates experiences that balance user needs with technological magic. It's a symphony of simple user interfaces that combine usability and innovation to create a digital battle in which users take the lead, directed easily by design movement. With that being said, hello everyone and welcome to this video on human-computer interaction examples by Edureka. Before we get started with the topic, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated on the latest tech content from Edureka. Also, visit the Edureka website for training and certification courses, the link to which is in the description box below. Let us take a quick look at the agenda for today's session. First, let's define what human-computer interaction is. Then, we will look at the rise of HCI. Then we will cover the importance of HCI and after that we will discuss the examples of HCI. Then move on to the components of human-computer interaction and finally we will look at the conclusion. Now without any further delay, let's get started. What is human-computer interaction? The multidisciplinary field of human-computer interaction deals with the development and assessment of technologies and computer systems that people use. It focuses on understanding and improving human-computer interaction to create more efficient, pleasurable, and user-friendly technology. Now you have a clear understanding of what HCI is. Let's move on to the rise of HCI. HCI was developed in the early 1980s to investigate how and why computers could be made more user-friendly. In a short period, the research area grew to include almost every aspect of IT. In 1984, Apple introduced the Macintosh, which changed everything. The use of computers has become much more widespread, making communication easier. The increasing recognition of the importance of user experience and user interface design has pushed HCI to the top. Companies are investing heavily in creating visually appealing and user-friendly interfaces. According to SixFigure.com, the average salary for a human-computer interaction professional is approximately 21.7 lakhs per annum in India. The estimated average pay for a human-computer interaction professional is approximately $249,000 per annum in the United States. Now we will discuss the importance of HCI. The potential of human-computer interaction to improve technological usability and design, making it more efficient and approachable, is what makes it so important. Here are some primary reasons for the importance of HCI. User satisfaction. HCI ensures that technology is designed to meet the needs, preferences and expectations of its users. This results in products and systems that users enjoy interacting with. Efficiency and productivity. Well-designed HCI can help users interact with technology more efficiently. Users can complete tasks more quickly and efficiently because of simple user interfaces and streamlined workflows. Error reduction. HCI design reduces the number of user errors by providing clear feedback, simple navigation, and user-friendly controls. This results in a more reliable and error-free user experience. Improving decision-making. Effective data visualization and information presentation, which are key aspects of HCI, assist users in making informed decisions. In fields such as data analytics and business intelligence, HCI is critical for transforming complex data into actionable insights. Innovation. HCI promotes innovation by challenging designers and developers to think creatively about how users interact with technology. This can result in breakthroughs in interface design and the creation of new types of interactions. Now we will discuss the examples of HCI. Human-computer interaction examples are all around us on various devices and applications. Here are some common examples. Cloud computing. In the framework of cloud computing, human-computer interaction entails creating user interfaces and experiences for interacting with cloud services. It focuses on creating user-friendly and efficient interfaces for tasks like resource supplies, monitoring, and managing cloud resources. The goal is to improve user satisfaction, usability, and overall experience in the cloud computing space. Pre-touch sensing. Human-computer interaction in pre-touch sensing examines interaction techniques before direct touch contact, which frequently involves closeness or action. It aims to create interfaces that respond to user actions even before physical touch, thereby improving user experiences. Eye tracking. 
Real-time eye tracking and human-computer interaction use this technology to immediately record and analyze users' eye movements as they happen. This allows for immediate feedback and flexible interactions, increasing the responsiveness and effectiveness of user interfaces. ChatGPT the focus of ChatGPT and human-computer interaction is on designing and improving conversational interfaces. HCI principles are used to design user-friendly and natural interactions with ChatGPT, taking into account natural language understanding, response consistency, and overall user experience. Artificial Intelligence HCI with AI involves including artificial intelligence in the design of human-computer interfaces. This collaboration aims to improve user experiences by integrating AI capabilities such as natural language processing and machine learning into interactive systems. Now you have a clear picture of the examples of HCI. Let's move on to the components. Human-computer interaction includes a wide range of components that contribute to the design and usability of technological interfaces. Here are some key components of human-computer interaction. User the user is the person who interacts with the computer or technology. Understanding user characteristics, needs, and preferences is critical for HCI. Interface. The interface is the point of interaction between users and the system. Interfaces may include graphical user interfaces, command line interfaces, voice interfaces, and others. Goal-oriented task. When using a computer, the user always have an objective in mind. To accomplish this, the computer displays a digital representation of objects. Context. HCI involves not only improving user-computer communication, but also considering the environment in which the system is used. Now we will dive into the conclusion. Human-computer interaction has grown rapidly as technology has become more integrated into daily life. HCI, which concentrates on user-focused design and makes use of improvements such as AI, ensure seamless and enjoyable interactions playing an important role in shaping the digital landscape. We will take a look at the certification provided by Edureka for HCI. Consider the Human-Computer Interaction for AI Systems Design course which Edureka offers in India in collaboration with the University of Cambridge Online. This course teaches students how to create user-friendly experiences for AI-powered systems and focuses on HCI principles. This course was curated and developed in collaboration with the University of Cambridge Online. After completing the Human-Computer Interaction for AI Systems Design course, you will receive a certificate from the University of Cambridge Online, which is widely accepted in the industry. Professor Per Ola Christensen heads up the University of Cambridge course online. He is a professor of Interactive Systems Engineering in the Department of Engineering at the University of Cambridge and a Fellow of Trinity College, Cambridge. For more information on the course lessons and the skills covered, please see the course link provided in the description box below. I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching and keep learning. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!